Deep in the African safari, a big African dog leads an unexpected rescue as animals struggle in thick, sticky mud after heavy rains. Nearby, the tallest giraffe carefully stretches its long neck to scout the area, guiding safari animals to safer ground. Tiny bugs buzz around the muddy pools while flying birds circle above, helping by alerting the herd with their calls. Together, the animals show how teamwork and awareness can make a difference in the wild. As the rescue continues, the African dog bravely pulls smaller animals free. Goats are among the oldest domesticated animals, raised by humans for over 10,000 years. Goats belong to the same family as sheep, called bovidae. Goats are raised for milk, meat, wool, and companionship. Goats have rectangular pupils, which help them see a wide view. Lions spend up to 20 hours a day resting or sleeping. They're most active at night, nocturnal, when it's cooler for hunting. Lion cubs are born blind and helpless, with faint spots that fade as they grow. Lions live mostly in Africa, grasslands, and open woodlands. A small population of Asiatic lions still survives in India's gear forest. Lions spend up to 20 hours a day resting or sleeping. Reindeer are one of the few deer species to have been widely domesticated, primarily by the Sami people of Northern Europe and other Arctic indigenous groups. Reindeer are surprisingly vocal. They make a variety of grunts and snorts, and a unique clicking sound. Reindeer can see light in the ultraviolet UV spectrum. Sheep are domesticated mammals that have been raised by humans for thousands of years. Sheep belong to the same family as goats, called bovidae. A sheep's body is covered in thick wool, which keeps them warm in cold weather. Sheep have horizontal pupils. Moose often feed on aquatic plants. They can close their nostrils, which acts like a valve to keep water out while they graze underwater. Moose have poor eyesight and are notably nearsighted, which is part of why they can sometimes be unpredictable around humans. White tigers aren't a separate species. They are Bengal tigers with a special color caused by a rare genetic change. White tigers can grow slightly bigger and stronger than regular Bengal tigers. White tigers use their sharp eyesight and stealth to sneak up on prey like deer and wild pigs. Ibises belong to the Thresci ornithidae family, which also includes spoonbills. Ibises are omnivorous, feeding on insects, crustaceans, small fish, frogs, and sometimes plants. Ibises are social birds, often living and nesting in large colonies. Ibises are migratory birds, traveling long distances between breeding and feeding grounds. Shoebills are carnivorous. They eat fish, frogs, water snakes, baby crocodiles, and even small turtles. The shoebill's large bill helps it grab slippery prey and crush it instantly with its sharp edges. Shoebills are usually solitary, preferring to live and hunt alone. 
Shoebills are sometimes called whale-headed storks. Flamingos belong to the Phenacopteridae family. Flamingos are very social. They live in large colonies that can include thousands of birds. Flamingos build cone-shaped mud nests to keep their eggs safe from flooding. Flamingo chicks are born gray or white and turn pink after eating carotenoid-rich food over time. Secretary bird is a large, long-legged bird of prey found mainly in sub-Saharan Africa. Secretary birds prefer open grasslands and savannas, where they can easily spot prey on the ground. Secretary birds mate for life and work together to build a huge nest, sometimes 2.5 meters, 8 feet wide. Donkeys are known for their strength and endurance. They can carry heavy loads and travel long distances, even in hot and dry deserts. Donkeys have large ears that can hear sounds up to 60 kilometers, 37 miles away in the desert. Their big ears also help them stay cool by releasing heat. Rhino beetle is a type of large, herbivorous insect belonging to the scarab family. Rhino beetles are considered one of the strongest animals on Earth relative to their size. They are capable of lifting objects up to 850 times their own body weight. Golden beetles are a diverse group united by their breathtaking physics-based coloration, which serves as one of the most brilliant examples of nature's artistry. Golden ground beetle, Carabus erratus, a large, predatory beetle native to Europe. It has beautiful, iridescent gold-green elytra, Spiders are not insects, they belong to a separate class of animals called arachnids. Unlike insects which have six legs, all spiders have eight legs. Spiders produce silk, but not all spiders spin webs to catch prey. This silk is a protein liquid that hardens as it is pulled from spinnerets located at the rear of their abdomen. Dung beetles are one of the few animals that can navigate using the Milky Way galaxy, helping them roll dung balls in a straight line. Dung beetles help clean the environment by removing animal waste. This stops bad smells, reduces flies, and keeps ecosystems healthy. Dung beetles live on most continents except Antarctica. Stage beetles include some of the largest and heaviest beetles in the world. The goliath beetle, a type of stage beetle, is one of the most massive insects on Earth. Stag beetles have been on Earth for tens of millions of years, meaning they shared the planet with dinosaurs. Ladybug is not a true bug, but is actually a type of small, round beetle. Their correct scientific family is Coccinellidae. Ladybug are not just for show, they are a warning to potential predators, like birds. Ladybugs are considered a gardener's best friend because they are voracious predators of plant-eating pests. 
ladybug is not a true bug, but is actually a type of small, round beetle. Yellow jackets are highly social insects that live in large colonies, often containing thousands of workers. Yellow jackets are famous for their aggressive defense of their nests. They can sting repeatedly and do not leave a stinger behind, unlike a honeybee. Yellow jackets also have a strong sweet tooth. In late summer and fall, Tigers are the largest wild cats in the world. Tigers are solitary animals, meaning they like to live and hunt alone. A tiger's roar can be heard from up to three kilometers, two miles, away. Tigers have orange coats with black stripes, but some are white due to a rare gene. A tiger's body can grow up to 10 feet, three meters long, including its tail. Polar bear is the largest bear species and the largest land carnivore on Earth. A large male can weigh as much as 10 grown men. Polar bear can consume over 100 pounds, 45 kilograms of blubber in one sitting. Hippos spend about 16 hours a day submerged in water to keep their massive bodies cool under the hot African sun. Hippos secrete a reddish, oily substance from their skin. This blood sweat acts as a potent moisturizer, antiseptic, and sunblock. Zebras belong to the horse family, Equidae. They're close relatives of horses and donkeys. Zebras can run up to 65 kilometers per hour, 40 miles per hour, to escape predators. Zebras eat mostly grass, but also leaves, herbs, and bark when grass is scarce. They spend most of the day grazing, and their strong teeth are made for chewing tough plants. Zebras live in groups called herds or harems, Giraffes were long thought to be mostly silent. However, recent research suggests they hum to each other, primarily at night, and they also communicate using snorts, grunts, and moans. Giraffes have the shortest sleep requirement of any mammal. Giraffe populations are declining, and they are classified as vulnerable to extinction mainly due to habitat loss, poaching, and civil unrest in parts of Africa. Bulls belong to the same species as cows, Bos taurus. Bulls are known for their muscular build, strength, aggression. Bulls can weigh anywhere from 1,000 to 2,400 pounds, 450 to 1,100 kilograms, depending on the breed. Horses have lived on Earth for over 50 million years. Horses belong to the Equidae family, along with zebras and donkeys. Horses usually live for 25 to 30 years. Horses can see almost 360 degrees around them, but they have two blind spots, right in front of their nose and directly behind them.
Dogs are descendants of wolves and were the first animals domesticated by humans. Dogs have been living with humans for over 15,000 years. Dogs belong to the Canidae family, which also includes wolves, foxes, and coyotes. Dogs have an incredible sense of smell, about 100,000 times stronger than humans. Dogs can see better than humans in the dark because of a special layer in their eyes called the tapetum lucidum. A dog's average body temperature is around 101 to 102.5 degrees for highs, 38 to 39 degrees Celsius. Animals show how teamwork and awareness can make a difference in the wild. As the rescue continues, the African dog bravely pulls smaller animals free. The giraffe gently nudges trapped friends toward dry land, and even the tiniest insects play a role by clearing paths in the mud. <laughs>